Welcome back. So much information to absorb, so little time to do it. That's why we invest a segment each week to filling some of the gaps by asking our panel, what did we miss, Jessica Colon? You know, Senator Dianne Feinstein is under attack in her Senate race from the socialist left. <laughs> I just want you to, I want that to sink in for a second. She is completely compromised in this entire hearing and her motives are indeed politically motivated because of the Senate race that she's enduring right now in her home state. Okay, Diane. Support. And what did you miss was Diane Feinstein is not the one that we should be concerned about. We should be concerned about Brett Kavanaugh's credibility. Mm -hmm. We should also be concerned about due process, both for the victim and the person who's being accused. We also need to be concerned about where Mark Judge is and why he has not gone ahead and committed to testify. So let's be concerned about the evidence, not Diane Feinstein. Stop deflecting, Republicans. Bob Price. <laughs> the construction of the border wall began in El Paso, Texas this week. A four-mile section of chain-link fence is being replaced by an 18-foot bollard wall. Wow, Ooh. tomorrow bell. That's Congratulations to everyone's favorite county judge, Judge Ed Emmett, Mental Health Diversion Center at 1215 Dennis Street. Uh, the opening is tomorrow at 9 a.m. Also, thank you to the manager of the Sears at Memorial City Mall and Rafir for helping me yesterday, Friday. Thank you very much. Bill King. I have an op-ed in the Houston Chronicle today. All the reasons you should vote against Proposition A, please join me in doing so. And let's put together a petition drive next year to create a real lockbox for Proposition A. Let's support A, Tony. Prop A. I'll be <laughs> delivering the State of Houston Latino Art 2018 this Wednesday, October 3rd Ooh. at Talento Bilingue Houston at 10 a.m. Okay. National Great Night job. Out. All right. National Night That's Out That's all Tuesday. the time we have. Thanks to our team. And remember, keep it right here. Fox News Sunday with Chris Wallace is coming up at the top of the hour. And please be sure and join us next week for the latest edition of What's Your Point? Have a great week, everyone.